Air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out what did your love interest think about you before they went to sleep last night. Today is the 30th of November, 2022. Time is 06.45 a.m. Bali Indonesian time and this is a collective reading for air signs if you were divinely guided to watch this video this message is meant for you even if you're dealing with the same air sign let's get your reading started spirits and angels please show me for air signs Gemini Libra and Aquarius their love interest what did they think of air signs before they went to sleep last night Three cups at the bottom of the deck. I think they were thinking about good times. Both of you may have, ha may have had some good times uh, that both of you have shared with each other. Good times, socializing with friends or family, um, going out together, doing things together. They were thinking about that. But we've got the Ten of Swords here and the Fool in Reverse. Something about risks, okay? Your love interest could have been thinking about certain risks that they are taking being with you and we've got the queen of cups here your person could be a pisces cancer or a scorpio or could be a fire sign aries sagittarius or a leo can be any sign okay and four of wands here is in love first they were thinking about how much they love you or that they have feelings for you but they're also sad about an ending okay some sort of an ending that both of you are actually not together right now physically okay could be not physically together or could have broken up but there is some sort of an ending to some celebration here with the three of cups or happiness so they could be thinking about their next action towards you right because the king of wands is the king of actions so thinking about actions plan um what to say to you next with the moon here and reverse to make a decision in regards to you, two of swords here in reverse. We've got the ten of wands in reverse. Mm. If you're separated from this person, uh, air signs, they they're really sad. They could be thinking about how how down they are. Or could be thinking about how they are making you sad. Yeah. Hmm. There's something that they have seen very clearly about you, air signs, that they they, they keep thinking about, right? Because the two of swords in reverse and the moon in reverse. Something about you, something that they didn't know before and now they know, something they didn't realize before and then now they realize about you, who you are as a person, essentially, or it could be secrets, it could be anything, but... Or it could be them thinking about how you have realized something about them. Something that you have found out in regards to them. Um, and it doesn't make them feel good, but the King of Wands right next to Four Swords here in reverse feels like a combination of a King of Wands and a King of King of uh, Swords. Because these are the swords, these are swords here as well. So taking actions planning, strategizing towards making a decision, towards revealing something, towards telling you something so that both of you could be happy together or to be reunited, to be reconciled. Let's see more. <coughs> Excuse me for the cough. Need to drink some water, just give me a second. <clears throat> mm. 
We've got the Five of Pentacles and then we've got the Devil here. Yeah, and they could be thinking about your intimacy. Both of you and both of you were intimate with each other. Six of Pentacles can indicate giving. So <laughs> it's a little bit dirty here, but um, Six of Pentacles and the Devil giving to each other, if you know what I mean. Giving to each other while being intimate, okay? They could be thinking about that in the tower, how mind-blowing it was how they really enjoyed it, okay? I don't see the tower as a bad card at all right now. We've got the five of pentacles and the nine of wands here, Emma, first. But there are some issues, air signs. They could be thinking last night before they went to sleep, something about money as well, or something about feeling abandoned, feeling rejected, feeling left out in the cold, or inability to take certain actions towards you right now because either they have some insecurity some fear or something that they are tied to or someone that they could be tied to if only if you know that if this person has somebody else or if you're involved in the third party situation because the three of cups six of pentacles and devil which could indicate that for some of you only if that's the case we've got the queen of wands here See, you've got the king and the queen here. So both of you are very compatible, uh, especially when it comes to being like in bed, okay? Sexual intimacy, physical intimacy, very compatible. So they could be thinking about the compatibility between the two of you. Um, you know, this is definitely very sexual to me. That's what I'm sensing here. But then there are issues within this connection that I think they're trying to figure out here with the Four Swords. Perhaps they need to make a choice, right, with the Two of Swords here eventually. But making that choice meaning needing to end something else or, you know, getting hurt or hurting the other person or hurting other prospects or ending a certain path in your life. It could be, it could be any of these things, okay? All right, I'm gonna pull out a few more. See, there are a lot of threes here. So for those of you air signs, if you do know that your person put, is putting you in a third party situation, or if you are putting your person in a third party situation, there's something here that I feel they could be thinking, I need to make a choice. And this choice will have to be very drastic. Very, it's a very big decision that will make or break this connection, okay? And we've got the Four of Cups here and the Ace of Swords in the first. Yeah, I don't think they're interested in other options, but if there is already someone else in the picture, I think they're kind of focusing on who should they choose or what they should choose. If it's not another person, third party may not always mean another lover. It could mean external factors, internal factors. That could be... Um, affecting this connection and with the ace of swords here in my verse they could be thinking about something you may have said as well as signs that they are not quite happy about it yeah and they could be thinking how should both of you work together as a team moving forward okay um if both of you are going to be compatible if both of you could come together again meet in the middle or be understanding um, with each other, something about needing a talk, a proper talk, and a decision that needs to be made, a very serious, important decision. All right, air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'll leave you with a couple of playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. The second playlist is from this channel, it has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions, but these readings are still new, so they're still relevant because I post them every single day. Um, in any case, Air Signs, I hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.